Now that you've seen the money beat in action, I'm just going to break down how a drum kit is put together. So basically, as you can see, we have a whole bunch of drums that are here, and then we have cymbals all along here. Let's take a look at the drums first. First of all, down here on my right foot, you can see I'm playing a drum with, with my right foot, with this pedal, and this is called the bass drum. And traditionally, this is quite a large drum, and that's what gives your beats that sort of oomph, right? There we go. And then up here, between our legs, we have what's known as the snare drum. Okay? And then here, these three drums are basically grouped together, and they're known as toms. And we have a high-pitched one here, a medium-pitched one here, and a low-pitched one here. Okay, so that's the drum is covered. Then we have all different kinds of cymbals here. In this course, we're actually only going to be using one cymbal. But as you can see there, there are different cymbals available to us. But this is known as the crash cymbal, and that's the one we're going to be using throughout this course. And then right here, we have what are known as the hi-hats. And there are two cymbals that are put together. Let me just lift this up so you can see it better. As you can see here, there's a, a bottom one down here and a top one up here. These are sort of like hybrid electronic symbols. That's why you can see this cable right here. That's a microphone in there. And I can play that with my left foot. And I can play it closed like this. And open like this. And there you have it. Now, as far as the money beats are concerned, we're only going to be using three drums. The bass drum that I play with my right foot. The snare drum between my legs. And the hi-hats right here. And there you have it. That's the basic traditional drum kit setup in a nutshell.